Good morning, YouTube! Welcome to the first ever Good Morning YouTube game show because I wanted to be challenged on my car knowledge. So I had April and Jake put together a format. So April, mm -hmm. what do we have going today? Well, we have a list of cars that have sold in the past year from mm -hmm. different sites. Now, you specialize, Elliot, in worldwide auctions. You work for them. Yes. And so we're going to pull three cars from your work, three cars from Tyler Hoover's work with Barrett Jackson, huh. and of course, Bob Cummings. We're gonna choose three from MMR, which is- In the dealer side of things. Dealer yeah. side, your specialty. Also one wild car. So a total of 10 cars that you guys are gonna to have to guess the auction price on each of these cars. Very nice, yeah. I wanted to be challenged, and these are the two guys probably within 100 miles that could challenge me the most, but you still probably don't stand a chance. But. Yeah, you worked in the auctions. Bob, you come to the auctions with me. You've been a dealer for over 30 years, so we'll see how this goes. So we're going to start with uh, Barrett Jackson comps? We're starting with Worldwide. Worldwide, auctions. okay. First, I really want some the competition. I want some predictions. Though. So we're who's, just guessing the, the who's gonna win. block price. It's tough, I would say, because I don't always, I'm not always right there when the hammer hits, so I don't know, much like you guys can't necessarily right. hear. Right. But Worldwide sells a lot less cars than Barry Jackson, so, so it's easier to remember. That is true. Mm -hmm. Hopefully um, it's not like just the one a few weeks ago, right? Right. Now, how long have you been working for Worldwide? Uh, two or three years now. Two probably. or three years, yeah. okay. Barry Jackson for? Four, going on five. Five, yeah. and, and Bob's Bob. been doing it since we Forever. were in diapers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So right. we have a total of nine cars from each of your particular specialized websites, shall I say. Also, one wild card car. <laughs> wild card car. Okay. From one of my favorite websites. All right. Which will be worth double points. So you can earn extra credit. You can also earn extra credit for doing Aww. things as such. I kissing up to me that. or kissing up to Jake. Oh. Well, extra points that for that. <laughs> All right. I got some scent points going strong. There we go. Yes. Yes. <laughs> We weren't going to say that word for Elliot to come back here. <laughs> it's all good. All right. Well, it's reflective to you. So car number one's from Worldwide, huh? Car number one okay. is from Worldwide. You're right. going to have to guess the hammer price. And it's not Price is Right rules. It's not, we can go over. It's just we whoever's the closest. Over. Whoever's okay. the closest. Okay. Very nice. Oh, I will right. show you an image oh, of this that's, that's even better. beautiful car right here. Oh. It's a 2002 Pontiac Trans Am Firehawk Coupe. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. which is the last year of the SLP Firehawk. One of Pontiac's true muscle cars, the Firehawk was an option package to the formula model. Mm. Now, they were shipped out to street legal performance in New Jersey to be tricked out. They got better performance, suspension, and a sweet air induction hood, badging, no heavy Trans Am ground effects. She's smooth and sleek. 1,501 were made manual, 345 horsepower from her LS1 and very low miles, just around 2,000. 2,000, okay. Miles yeah. is yes. be mm -hmm. yeah. Elliot, I also All have right. a question on yes. this listing. It says, uh, highly original. So what is that? That's like a gray that area. Is, that is pretty interesting. With only 2,000 miles, I mean, I'd like to think it's entirely original. Maybe tires? Because I don't think anybody would modify something if they're going to keep it. It's just auction speak. Like there, but yeah, because mm -hmm. they don't want to be Right, you don't want to be, say, completely original in case... And then yeah, somebody says, feel... the tires aren't original. Right, right. They... so that's probably yeah. something like that. Nothing major, for sure. Right, yeah, the, the Firehawks are cool, but they don't bring as much as the Trans Ams, usually. True. But last year, manual, hmm. low miles. Yeah, hmm. okay. 2002, how many miles? 2002, 2,120 miles. Because yeah. this is the end result price? Yeah, right. it's, the, it's the total with fees. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. okay, well, okay, well, I'm mm. thinking of hammer price, so I have to... Hammer. Okay, Here we go. I have to adjust a little bit okay. For, okay. for fees. All right, Elliot, I guess go ahead. I should have adjusted for fees, but I'm going to stay with this because okay. it's a fire. 37. Wow. 37. Oh. I'm at 41069. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> Look at, look at us. Look, I was oh, 38. Oh, we were, no. Look at that. No. We were, this is I pretty said, impressive. I already actually. regretted adju not adjusting. 38, for fees. and then there's my adjusted uh, fee. Very so nice. Mm. How are you guys so good at this? What is it? You are the We're biggest pros. car well, nerds it? ever. <laughs> oh, yeah? First of all, you are so close. How much? With a total of $43,680. Oh. Bob is oh, the are. winner. Yay. One point awarded. You crossed Bob. it out, darn it. No, but it was the final uh, answer. Uh, so that's legit. Okay. Good job, Bob. That's legit. First that was point. my final answer. Mm. I'm already missing out on my own auction. Car number two from Worldwide Auctions. Are you ready? 
keep going with that. All right. Yeah, yeah. three right. worldwide. Okay. Be Feast Ritz. your eyes on this 1958 Cadillac okay. Eldorado Baritz convertible. 18 feet, 5 inches of American glory. The long end. Yo, yeah. Mm. She's got the 365 Caddy V8. You got the quad headlights, tiny Dagmar, the bullets in the grill. Like, what's not to like about this? Okay, right. is it original or restored? It's listed as highly original. Highly original. Again, mm. a little bit of a, a gray area. I may be way off. 815 were produced. This one has 60,000 miles. Well, okay. There's a lot more Impalas that sell, a lot of 59 Cadillacs that everybody saved. I, I don't know. I'm ready. I'm going bigger. On this okay. One. What do you got? I went with 115. 115. Wow. Which would do mm. sometimes more than I think they would. Huh. Mm. Well, I'm at $85,000. Wow. So I guess I'm a little low. Yeah. No. Are you at 86, Bob? No. Please. No. <laughs> Please, no. no. I am. 175,000. Whoa. Some of those Honestly, cars some of them are okay. crazy. Yeah. Mm. And I'm always surprised like when I'm watching these auctions. Right. Because a lot yeah. of times I, I, I record these auctions sure. and then I watch them. And it's like while I'm working and, sure. and listing cars and stuff, it just gives me a pulse of the market. Well, so like a 59 could bring yeah, that if it's convertible. Sure. And I feel I like that's not as desirable, yeah, so that's why right. I just went down yeah. a lot from no, there. I, think I, you're right. I was thinking yeah, I think, along the same lines mm -hmm. there. I think I was way, I think I'm way over, but. So what is it, April? The total is $94,080. Oh, there we go. Well, there's no penalty for being well, stolen. There we go. There we go. Far over. Oh. So I'm Tyler on the board. gets a point. I should have been on the board for the yeah. first one, too, oh, but Bob got to change. Oh, uh, no, so. no, don't even try that. Okay. <laughs> but no, you were right. I didn't you were consider right. that. Elliot, this is your auction, I know, man. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, I, the one that I should be doing this well This is at. your auction. Come on. I'm busy during these times. Well, I am, too. But I <laughs> so still we'll see. Maybe I'll do great at the Bear Jackson ones. All right. This next one I went with because I've heard that you're a specialty in pre-war okay. cars. Oh, oh crap. Well, the old we'll school. Yeah. So I didn't want to okay. leave that out Thank because you. I know, you but know, their specialties really are different. Yeah. Right now. <laughs> and that, that was your thing. Worldwide okay. auctions sure. has a lot mm -hmm. of those yes. kind of cars. Mm -hmm. So we're going with a 1936 Packard 120 convertible mm. coupe. Now, Very Packard, nice. made right here in America in our automotive mm -hmm. part of Detroit, Michigan. She's wearing baby blue paint, fitted with the iconic 1930s rumble seat, and of course, perched on its leading edge is the goddess of speed, or as Tyler would say, the fast woman. Did you call her? <laughs> or the fast oh, lady? <laughs> yeah, the flying lady or the whatever. The flying yes. lady. Uh -huh. before. Now, what do we know about condition? Um, highly original. The oh. condition is, take a peek closer, mm. is how I would say that. 120 horsepower straight eight, three speed manual, 55,000 were made. I love me a straight eight. Yeah. These 50, later. 55,000 were made. 55,000. 5,500. 5,500. See, I was going to say, I was changing my 55,000. Not to help you guys out, but these later Packards, even though it's pre war, they don't bring as much no. as yeah. the earlier, you know, the, the uh, round right. late 20s, early 30s yeah. one. It, it just goes off a cliff. Uh, but this one is a convertible rumble seat in great shape yeah. and straight eight, so... I know, there were a couple of these that were tan that sold at the last one. Mm -hmm. well, maybe blue, I'm trying to think if that'll help or hurt it. Right. Mm. Is that an original color? So you I have reference, know. probably. Sounds like. yeah. You have well, reference. Not, I'm still shooting busy. from the hip on this one. I'm I don't watch these cars. more than I would normally... All right, but, Elliot. I know. It's my last Elliot, chance Elliot, this here. is your site. <laughs> this is the company you <laughs> work for. I'm not a Packard man necessarily, but I'm going with 140. Okay. I know yeah. it seems high, Okay. but I've seen, like, depending on the Packard and condition mm. and everything like I started that. out higher. I was low. Ask the man who owns mm, one, I guess. I don't have one, but yeah, $69,000. Oh, okay. I see okay. what you did there. Okay, mm -hmm. well, I'm in the middle nice. of you guys. Okay. 88. Man, I went mm. way high. You get but, I, but I, I was 130 it's, initially. Just gave it away. Bob, Were you? Bob, Bob yeah. How, how did Tyler get so close? Literally, 68,400. <laughs> I, I told you, oh they don't bring that much. So yeah. close. Oh, my oh. gosh. Well, now Tyler's got two. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's like you knew. I swear Tyler did not cheat. This morning he did ask and say little things. And I didn't give him anything. Yeah, to this I gave him nothing. <laughs> well, nothing. She did that for you, but it's really more. I know. Will help. It really was. Yeah. I mean, they sell these at your out, auction, but that's Struck out 100% kind of at my auction. Yeah, but not voting. Well. I've shopped for these quite a bit, wanting to get a straight eight right, Packard and all that stuff. These, so I've yeah, done a lot of looking. Right, yes, true. and I haven't pounced on one yet. Mm. All right, so what's mm. next? Are we moving into my wheelhouse next, or we're ours? we're going to the Barrett Jackson auction. All right. Okay, where thousands of cars go across the block, so you're probably not going to remember. 
it is really hard to, to choose and to narrow it down. But I thought that this would be exciting for all of you. Yes. Okay. Millennium oh, no. Yellow 50th Anniversary oh. 2003 Corvette mm. Z06 Custom. I'm sorry. Mm. If that doesn't get you the front of the line of the Golden Corral, check out the Jeez. custom butterfly <laughs> doors, 20 inch custom wheels, powder coated to match. It's got the 5.7 LS6, 405 mm. horsepower, six speed manual transmission, 12,925 12, miles. 12,000 miles and it's been ruined. So I'm a Corvette guy, but yeah. Mm. Is there a pimp my ride sticker on it somewhere? Woof. There is not. And don't worry, it also comes with a second hood with War Eagle emblem on it. <laughs> which well. which option? Well, was, this, was this Palm Beach? It kind I of can't there. give away any clues. Because well, anyway. you're going to remember. Was it Scottsdale? Was it Palm Beach? There's zero. That can make a difference. Zero clues. Huh. Huh. Low mileage, though, and being an 03, it's more desirable. Yeah, it has the 405 yeah, yeah, horsepower, the full 405. So, mm -hmm. uh, uh, But this is two people that want it. <sighs> I got to say. <laughs> yeah. One person and the auctioneer. Elliot, go ahead. It's low, but 25. That is low. Because mm. it's just so, wow. But it's 13,000 miles. I know, I'm but sure that's it's the like, thing. It's low for I did 33 much. just because of the miles and just two people can get, get really worked up over this that's stuff. True. Some boomers could Somebody go, love it. whoa. And yeah. I'm mm. so far away from you. 32? Oh my gosh. Mm. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Grand total of 31,900. Oh. That's Bob. That's wow. Me. That's that me. was close. See, the, Very nice, Bob. I'm 100 away. <laughs> I, I, let the Very mods, nice. I let the mods get to my head. I was like, oh, that I don't even close. want this. That was we were close. close again, Bob. Yeah. Huh. That was $100 off. Danger. Of yeah. Yeah. Elliot? Yeah. Sig over here. It's been great. <laughs> Are you guys ready for we're this? Ready. We're ready. This beauty, mm -hmm. which I would like to add to my uh -oh. collection, which uh -oh. I don't have a collection, but if I did, this would mm. be in it. I'm curious Are you ready? What we got here. 1968 Ooh, Mustang right. Bullet Resto Mod, uh, ground up build. She's got a new 670 horsepower supercharged five liter Coyote, six speed automatic with manual sport mode shift capability. Now the Loker automatic shifter is all dressed up inside mm -hmm. to look like the movie correct manual and like any good Resto Mod mm -hmm. has all the goodies inside, vintage air, Bluetooth, leather wrapped shelf So they had two wheel. of them at the same time selling. And one, they did a matte finish and that one didn't bring nearly as much as this one that would. I, I don't you know. This no, I don't remember the exact money, this but I knew it brought a lot more is than the matte the, finish. This is the matte this finish is one. The matte finish. It's, it's finished of, in the best okay. Mustang color of ever, Highland Green. Highland Green, Green Metallic. With a right. matte clear coat mm -hmm. on it. It's very well documented. Mm -hmm. Just under a thousand miles since the build. rest of the mods are. Crazy. Mods are weird because. Yeah. But it's, again, it's back to that money. people want it. And that's that's the place to do it. Is bear check people get really excited about this. But it's it's a, it's a stroker engine, right? It, oh, it's a coyote, so it's better. Coyote. Okay, yeah. all right. So, like, so that's cool. better. That usually it's makes me more. It's a lot of money, more. though, to yeah. build. I just remember because it was matte and it didn't do as well as the other one, even though this one had the better build. But they've made the bad decision, I think, to mm. do matte. So mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Tyler, let me I, I see. Listen over here yeah, mm -hmm. you're getting some tips. I gotta, I gotta or maybe help he's you throwing you it out on purpose. Yeah, this is you don't know. Hazy. I'm hazy. Were you were you just peeking at their answers? Oh, I've already written it down, so <laughs> I'm not. I, I'm, I'm, I'm sheltering my. I was, more, never, I was more on your thing, and I was like, yeah, I'll shoot a little higher. Because I know people get pretty stoked. Yeah. You, know, you get a few cocktails mm -hmm. in you at that that oh, event, and yes. everything gets all. All right, Elliot. All right. One with 165. Okay. Ooh. I'm a 145. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look at us. Wow. Well, well, see, that means I'm probably. You guys are okay. all way well, I was higher. low. We're way low. Way really? low. Two hundred and forty-two thousand wow. dollars. I guess I gave you guys bad directions. Yeah, because you know which, what my number by was. By the way, it means yeah. I get a point. You know what my Jack number was? Elliot gets it was one seventy-five. <laughs> Really? It was yeah. 175. See, I was thinking 140. Then he talked about the map. I was like, hey, yes. I, you know, I know people. And he threw me off. Yeah, he threw huh. me off. See, I think that might be strategy. Yeah. Well, yeah. all right. I also think for the Bear Jackson ones, is it a Friday night? You know, because that That's does. True. Everyone gets I just didn't. I stuff. misremembered. So maybe it was the other way around. The Matt one did better. <laughs> See, now yeah. he's reversed. Uh, See? That's why you have to watch it on TV. Good for you. Okay. I didn't remember that. You're still miles away. I'm still, yeah, way in the dirt. The rest of mods are just impossible because the two people in the room could bid a million bucks on that, and you don't, you just don't know. It, it, it's hundred thousand dollars swing. People get it so mm -hmm. worked mm -hmm. up, and it's they just, yeah, dumb. This next one again was for Elliot. Well, mm. no, well because see, you came on our show before and taught us all valuable life lessons, so I okay. feel like 
So we did this one, me one for you again. Mm -hmm. Okay. 1936 oh, Bentley four and a quarter liter Park Ward drop head mm. coupe. Mm. Again, Weird. Tyler's going to know. Yeah, Tyler's going to know this. That was a really cool yeah. Survivor. Look at the paint. It was yeah. sort of. Take a look of, at the condition. Yeah. Yeah, you can tell even the top. It's very now. The mm -hmm. sales literature back in the day called it the silent sports car because mm -hmm. it had um, 96 um, miles an hour for its top speed. Mm -hmm. Is it 36? 1936. Okay. This is a barn find. It's all original. It was parked in the garage since the early 70s. Mm -hmm. The exterior and interior are complete. It also comes with its original toolkit and copies of the original paperwork. I wanted this bad. Yeah. Bad. Now, take a look at the condition. So you, know the car, in. Mm -hmm. so you do know what it went for. I don't remember exactly. You inadvertently put this in if you, if you were, if you were I didn't mean to. I'm trying to help Elliot I know, out. Well, you got a Tony <laughs> car. And they're at Bear Jackson, which is not exactly the market for that type of thing, which mm -hmm. means it could have gone lower, but the fact that Tyler wanted it and didn't mm -hmm. get it means it went for Just higher. because it was hoopty. It was yeah. it was like a hoopty version of it, but it, the perfect patina. So I'm, I'm write her down. Like way survivor here on this one. Mm -hmm. So I'm, you're not pre-war, like that's not your jam? No. What is, like where's your well, sweet like the, spot? The 80s, 90s, 2000s, the, yes. the ones that I've won. Right. <laughs> see. So flip her around. Too much. 65. Oh my gosh. See, see I, I, went, so I went over. You 90. Wow. You went to 90, okay. yep. But it just these. I'm just gonna leave it. What? You're, you're flipping around. You know, two hundred and thirty. No, <laughs> that is no, no, lofty, no. But no. You, you could work. I the think Bentleys and Rolls Royces, unless they're like blower That's Bentleys. That's okay. I don't know these. Cars. Like, like, really, this one just yeah. total spitball. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Fifty-five thousand. Wow, nice, Elliot. Oh, hey. oh, Very oh, nice. Yeah. Gee, okay. I was only off by a couple hundred. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Perfect. So we're all. Yeah, and you can see where I We're all tied up. Yeah, we're all tied up. Oh my mm -hmm. God. As we get into Bob's wheelhouse. Yeah. I, I feel like if I lose by over 100, I should get a point deducted or something. <laughs> so we worked our way through the public auctions now. Now we go into the hoopty dealer sale, okay. right? Okay. Yeah. MMR, Bob, explain what the MMR site is to well, us peasants that aren't allowed to go on and find out. Mannheim Auction is basically the largest wholesale auction network in the world, probably. Mm -hmm. And. Uh, I mean, I don't know how many cars hundreds of locations they sell. And hundreds maybe. of thousands of cars on on the site. Maybe a the week site. they sell a hundred thousand a week. It's, it's crazy. Yeah. yeah. And mm -hmm. MMR is Mannheim Market Research, which mm -hmm. basically so the more common the car is, right? The kind of the more accurate MMR is going to be because mm -hmm. there's more examples. Um, you know, so if it's a 2015 Toyota Camry, mm -hmm. you know, there's going to be 50 examples, and, and so it basically More just, 500 of yeah. that, yeah. Right. But mm -hmm. it takes the mileage, it takes the condition, mm -hmm. you know, it, it lists the mileage and condition, and then the a hammer price, mm -hmm. right? And then MMR is the average of all of those cars, and you can adjust mileage, condition, and all that stuff to get an idea. Mm -hmm. So you go up to a car, you scan the VIN number, right. and it pulls up, you know, my app, it pulls up the average mock auction price, and then you change a few little things, and then it'll give you an idea of this is what this car should sell for. Should sell for. Our. So for our purposes, it's just the base MMR right. with the average mileage, the average right. condition, no adjustments, just right. whatever the straight MMR is. That's right. Okay. Right. okay. All right, cool. All right. So what do you got for us? Ready? Okay, the apex predator of the American highway system. If you see someone weaving through traffic with one window made huh. of packing tape and a missing taillight, it's probably an Altima. I was going to say Altima. Oh, no. 2012 Nissan Altima V6 four-door sedan. So that, that specifically is 2012. That's, uh, 2012. Those are CVT. See, I was going to say that's CVT. So, but 2012. 2012. What's the mileage? Well, there's no mileage. It's just yeah, the MMR average, average, average mileage. Oh, average. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. And there's okay. been a lot of bad ones. See, look, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to adjust yeah, that. That's the thing because most of them are bad ones. most of them are total <laughs> junk. So the MMR is going to be very, very low. Um, I almost want to mm. go crazy low, but yeah, big yeah, Ultima see. energy. <laughs> All right, here we go, Elliot. I went with five thousand. Oh, you're insane. There's no way. I had twelve hundred bucks. Hmm. Thirty-two seventy-five. Wow. Okay. Three thousand two hundred seventy-five dollars. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Not thirty-seven thousand. No. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm being very generous with mine. You're real weak on this. What are you? Why are you thinking that? Because they're, they're everyone that goes through is just total junk. Yeah. 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 They're, all okay. they're all ruined. Bad transmissions. Yeah. Four thousand one hundred dollars. Uh, that's me. No. Okay. No. Wait, yep, I, 75. Yeah. 
Dang. That yep. was pretty mm-hmm. close. Four thousand one hundred dollars average base. Okay. Price. Yeah, I put that seventy five yeah. on there. Huh? Good. <laughs> oh, I forget that any car Ultima. that moves at this point is it, worth a yeah. couple of grand. There's like, oh yeah, in, in today's it, market, it's exactly. nuts. It's, it's, yeah, there's no twelve hundred. See, because I used to be that's the in op sale. I used to be in Bob's <laughs> world with used cars. I go to the auction, and that's been ten years now. And ten years ago, that like a ten year old Altima was. Worth it. So, bucks, yeah. all right, I gotta adjust for this new world we live right. in. Okay. Yes. So, what is the range on that? Yeah, the lowest was thirteen hundred. Yeah. So, what I wrote down, yeah. And the highest was seventy six hundred. So we pulled this. Wow. wow. They said the pristine one. So it's all about condition. Averages, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. It's all about condition. But most right. of them are crap, so it doesn't. Okay. Bring it I'm behind now. Ready for the next car? Mm-hmm. I'm ready. All right, it's the ride of choice for suburban mothers to do five under the speed limit in the left lane. Functional blinkers were an added cost option. BMW. <laughs> it's a 2012 BMW <laughs> X5 35i. Okay, it's a 35 now. Yeah. Okay. 2012. 2012. Did we just go with 2012s across the board? So it's being <laughs> traded in because its turbos are blown or the engine's noisy. It needs everything. 2012, you said. So 10 years old. BMW X5. But it's still an X5. Tyler, don't embarrass me. I'm sorry. <laughs> Better get this right. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. 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 The reveal, which again feels high. All right. Ready? Everything's weird today. Go for it. $12,000. That sounds ridiculous. It sounds That's crazy. insane. I know. But I felt like I was high at 8100 bucks. Okay. You're both high as a cat. Yeah. 47, which I mean Bob would know. So well, we're going to find out. Yeah. Bob, you are so good. 4,775. Oh. <laughs> You're not even kidding me. Oh my gosh. You are You're within 20 bucks. But he scans one of those every damn week <laughs> and doesn't good. buy it because it's junk. <laughs> this actually works oh. in my favor sometimes. Mm. MMR, because like MMR is so low. Right. Mm-hmm. And then there'll be a really, really good one. Nice one. Right. Yeah. Right. That comes through and uh, and I'll pay 2,000 over MMR. For oh, yeah. It. I was so, thinking of everybody who I... shops for these who wants a BMW and doesn't know yet. I was thinking <laughs> around five, like, yeah. and I just got so blown out last time. Yeah. I thought, okay, I'll go yeah. higher. All right, now yeah. I just need to go back to my instincts because yeah. Bob's going to run away with this. Yeah. He's, oh, up by, he's up by two now, oh, so yeah. well, this, is, this is it. Right? This is the last regular question. Now, the lowest for that was 3,600. Highest was 6,500. Right. Oh, the highest was 6, But you know, I'm going to tell you a crazy yeah. thing about this MMR. I go to these auctions, and you know, an MMR is a moving target, mm-hmm. okay? But what's crazy is you go... Every week I go to these auctions and MMR is forty five hundred dollars and the vehicle's selling for seven thousand mm-hmm. dollars. Right. If it's usable, because yeah, because like it's crazy. Nineteen out of twenty are, are ruined junk, and so the one good one sells for double, right? right? But it doesn't make so. sense because these are the MMR's actual results, but it's just like MMR is a guideline. It, yeah. It's when my experience is, it's like everything's over. Okay, mm-hmm. all right, all last right. chance Ready? for us, Elliot. Car Even. number nine. You can't throw a stone without hitting the rusted bedside of Chevy's top seller. 2015 Chevy Silverado 1500 four-wheel drive crew cab LT 5.3 V8. Okay. So four-wheel drive? Yeah. Four-wheel drive. And what year? And it's a 15. 2015. Which means it's the 15. Got the soft drop bed and everything, all the nice features. Mm-hmm. Yes, it also has the soft drop yes. lifters. Right. <laughs> it's a four-door truck. Four-wheel drive crew cab. Uh, four-wheel drive crew cab. It's a 1500? 1500 LT yeah. 5.3 V8. Yeah. Okay. okay. Elliot? I went with $20,000. Oh. I know. Well, I was higher. I went twenty one. Oh. Yeah. What? <laughs> Did Bob, do you at least add some sense? It's an LT. It's like the top trim four wheel drive. drive. I'm seven years old. The truck market's crazy. You put 9,700 bucks. Whoa. Okay. Okay. All right. Base price. $13,500. $13,500. Who Bob, is the I'm winner? Still, yeah. You're <laughs> still in. Yeah. Bob gets the point. But here's the point you guys aren't understanding. There's so many bad ones. There are. It's bringing the average down. Mm. I know, but mm. you know, like the four-wheel drive and all that stuff, that's not the work truck. You know, I figured yeah. that's the one that's right. bringing the average down. So, I'm oh, ho- wow. I'm absolutely hopeless. So Bob has... Bob, Bob is... Bob, but the double points, I guess, oh, is right. for second Bob place, Elliot. Yeah. five points. Elliot and Tyler are tied for second. Look, look at with two, two points. points. Um, the lowest for this one was 6,500, highest 25,750. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I guess they just all get so That one rusted. anomaly actually, I was probably. actually closer. If you throw out that one anomaly, I'm yeah. actually probably a lot even closer than. The, the, right, the, right. the East Coast and the Northern trucks get all rusted do, and they ruined and it, it drags it all down. Mm-hmm. So. Because yeah. there's a lot yeah. of input on that one. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. 
I see these trucks. I've lost. Making, that's true. So my bubbles burst. We have the bonus one. It doesn't matter. Whatever. Okay, oh, what on. is it? You're not being a game show You're going to get now. five points with this bonus round. This is the electric bonus round. Are you ready? Oh, you're making are five you points ready? now? Are you ready? Now? Okay. It's a serious well, competition. Remember, win, man. Bonus wins, essentially. <laughs> it all boils down to one. It five doesn't points. Know. Okay. Let's, let's just be dignified in our defeat. Okay. Mm -hmm. And well, go I for a second. Yeah. All right. If you so, beat me, I'm just going to... I know. Then you're going to walk off the show. Yeah. I'm just going to walk that way. I'm an observer in this one. Well, go ahead and play. Why not? Go ahead. Rub it in. Yeah. Just keep. Yeah. yeah, we'll just see. We'll what just do we got, see. April? Mm -hmm. All right. This is from Cars and Bits. Daddy Doug. From Daddy Doug. All right. Are you ready for this? I'm... Powerhouse. 2011 Saab oh, 95 with the Ultra this is Rare. Bob's. Six speed manual last year. Oh, from I love Saab, Saab's. One of the quirkiest automakers. Yes. Front wheel drive, 260 horsepower, two liter turbocharged four cylinder. So it's, it's the end of the line for Saab. It's yeah. a manual transmission. Mm -hmm. One uh -huh. of 151 manual transmission 9.5 sold in the U.S. What's the miles? 62,000 miles. So some crazy Swede fan gets the end of the line Swede one with the stick, but it does have some miles on it, but it's still probably the nicest surviving one to come for sale for a long time. It also has the technology package. Head up uh, display, parking sensors, lane that's departure a tricky warning. One. That, you know, like, don't follow this car. Right. Well, there's not many of them because they, yeah, they were, they were done. There's none to follow. I, mean, I, I have mm -hmm. followed them, but I don't <laughs> yeah. follow sales of them, I guess. Right. The point. So, I'm uh, also I'm I'm taking into this account that this is the kind of place that you would go to buy one of these. Right. Elliot, uh, give us a flip. Crazy. At 18.5. Whoa. Ooh. I'm at 11. Oh, mm. my gosh. And uh, now tell me how they're rating. Are, are they warm? You get us you feedback can, on Are we warm or cold? It's right in the middle of them. Oh, hey. Bob. And Bob's probably right in the no, middle of us. No, no, You're I, out. No way. You're out. You're out. Because right. that's, a, that's a kind of car that people yeah, would could just be. stupid on. Yeah, Because that's it is a saying. unicorn. Yeah. I believe that. All right. Yeah. So what did it end up? Right in the middle. I'm not good at math, so you guys are gonna have to figure it out. Fourteen hundred five hundred. Fourteen thousand five hundred dollars. That's it. Fourteen thousand five hundred dollars. <laughs> and you are. Well, I put a five hundred. You're four thousand. So. So it's you. I win! You, you win. Well, wait a second. Who's a her? Tyler yeah. is the yeah. first place loser. Third, Bob, huh? you're good. Know work, your Bob. stuff for sure. Good work, Bob. We're gonna have to do a rematch because this is. <laughs> it's too fun, actually. Congratulations, it is brutal, Bob. Though. Well, thank you. You I win a prize. Um, I I don't have a prize. I'm sorry. You but... could give him your waffle trophy. Oh, there you go. <laughs> thank you so much for watching.